bit hot. Oh, it's okay. What are you saying? Hey, say hello me. Hello me. Hello me. Hello me. Hello me. Hello me. I cut you. I yes. Thumbs up. Mm. I like it. <laughs> Dad, you got you got Bobby Finn. I'm in such a good mood today. I feel like if you were to look up disheveled in a picture version dictionary, the picture version of a dictionary, my face would come up. I feel like I'm looking very weathered today. I haven't really been sleeping. I've been having like extra bad pelvic pain and just like, you know. I'm also gonna skip my skincare routine, which isn't good for anyone, particularly my face, because I just feel in the winds, in the atmosphere that I'm gonna go for an ocean swim today. And if I feel like I'm gonna swim in the morning, I'm just like, I'm not gonna do a skincare routine. So I'm just gonna spray some of my Esme mist and just do like a fake, just do a fake cheat version of my morning routine. But I'm so excited for so many reasons for this vlog and just for this day, because number one, it is 10 days till Christmas. 10 days till Christmas, what the heck? We have something planned every single day until the lead up to Christmas, whether it's like photo shoots for work or like a big Christmas party I'm hosting. So today's like my day to organize everything. Aside from the Christmas shenanigans, and I'm also about to go to acupuncture, which I'll bring you guys along. But the most exciting part is I'm finally getting a door. Since Kurt and I have lived together, we've never had an ensuite door. It just so happened our last apartment, the previous owners removed the door from the ensuite. Nowadays, I don't care, but the thing I hate is, let me show, I feel like I explained this, but you never get to see what I'm talking about. So like when you're sitting on the toilet, this is the door and through this window, like through this door, it directly looks into next door's window and it's like their hallway, like their staircase. And this is my shower. So like POV of us having family showers, we're in the shower and you can see all the way, like the neighbors can fully see us, which is fine because you're like, why don't you just shut the door? Like stop being so dramatic. Yes, but I have a toddler who runs in and out, especially like when I'm on the toilet, he just like, he thinks it's funny to open the door. So I can't wait to finally get a door here in the ensuite. What's for? Foxy doing. Fox has been independent playing so well. Like today and last vlog was the first vlog ever that it's like me and him at home and he lets me vlog. Hi gorgeous, what are you doing? I'm You're no, working? I'm going, now you know, go! You want me to leave? Yeah. Okay, see ya. When he's working, like tradie work, he likes to work alone. So he has like hammers, nails. His room's a mess, but it means he's having fun. Kurt is currently in the office and our team is in the office and we communicate on a thing called Slack. It's kind of like MSN, so whatever. We like text each other on the computer. And the girls from the office text me today saying they all brought their cozies. If you don't live in Australia, cozies equals swimwear equals bathers. So they all text me saying they brought their cozies to work and they're gonna go for a swim in the ocean at lunchtime which like what an epic lunch break so hopefully after acupuncture I can go meet them at the beach with Fox a lot of the time if I'm doing like computer work I am in our office but with this baby coming I assume I can just foresee me being at home more just like breastfeeding him with Fox with baby I'm in the process of doing up my home office Look at my new table. I think it's actually a dining room table, but it has this like board in there that you can put like a power cable in. <laughs> Is it cool? And the cables go down the leg. I need to organize all of that, but what do you think? The table. Do you like it? Yeah. I want to touch this. Yeah, you can touch. Say thumbs up. Looks awesome, Mum. Wood. wood. It is wood. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. <laughs> Room is a mess. Absolute mess. Have you been working in here? Yeah. Yeah, I can tell. So we're gonna go tag team and you're gonna swap with dad. Mum's gonna go get acupuncture. And then, yeah. listen to this. Yeah. We're gonna go for a swim later. And we'll, maybe we can pick up the jelly blubbers again. Yeah. Yeah? All right, let me get my bag and we're just gonna go to the office. I'm gonna drop Fox there. Yeah. Go show them the stanky leg. Stanky leg. Stanky leg. Stanky, yes! This is my Wanna put them on in the car? We can be twins. No, put them in my car. Yeah, boys. Woo! Let's yeah. go. Okay. You ready to go? Yeah. Let's go. What a beautiful day, huh? Yeah. Foxy's in the car. He's excited. Yeah. See you, bud. Yeah, hi, iPad. 
Bye. See you, big dog. Yeah, I've got a bad pad for you, man. I've got a bad pad. Are you ready to go? Yep. Yeah, you got it, man. Yep. Let's go. Yeah. Dry his iPad, yep. Bye. I love you. I would love nothing more than to have the confidence, my old school confidence back to bring this big vlogging camera. Can you see in the mirror? You know what the camera looks like. Like it's big and bulky. I would love nothing more than to bring you guys into the acupuncture studio, but the practitioner that I'm getting acupuncture from, I've never met her before. So I don't want to like be like, hi, I'm Sarah. I'm a vlog, like, I feel like eight years ago, I could bring my camera anywhere and people thought I was doing like a school assignment but I feel like so many people are vloggers now that I get like embarrassed being like hi can I vlog you so really I love you I I love you I do and I want to bring you guys along but I'm just gonna go in there leave my camera in the car because I just I don't have the confidence to be like hi I'm Sarah I'm a vlogger can I film you talk to you soon Acupuncture was really nice and relaxing. It was honestly just to open up my pelvis and kind of prepare my body for birth. But I got home, I noticed the boys were still out. They were actually getting my Christmas presents. So I used this as a little 15 minute opportunity to go for an ocean swim. What the actual heck? I know. You've got salt on your belly. I know. No, I think that's maybe just stretch marks coming. <laughs> I'm 28 weeks as of You're yesterday. Massive. You're actually massive. I know. Like, people... That was like you full term last time. I know. People have asked if I've got stretch marks yet. Not that I can see yet, but I wouldn't be surprised. I didn't get them at all with Fox. I Show already. Us. I have stretch marks here from puberty, but I wouldn't be surprised. I don't think you'll be Show able to. Show us your belly. I reckon you'll get them. Sarah's got a pretty red hot routine of like oils. Like you get a shower and you're like oil. oil I know, up but and you're... it's it's very genetic. It's like oils only do so much. It's like if your skin reaches a point of like no return, it just, just it stretches so quick. It, it stretches quick. You yeah. want to have collagen in your diet. It's more about your cells than topical. So I don't have them yet, but I wouldn't be surprised if I get them with this pregnancy because I am tracking two weeks bigger. And with Fox, I was tracking like two weeks smaller. So my body is like not used to being. But right now, look what arrived. We can't even put it up because Fox is asleep. <gasps> Our barn door. Finally, oh, really? finally some yeah. privacy. We haven't had an ensuite door ever, no. <laughs> ever in no. our whole relationship. Yeah. Our last place didn't have one either. Yeah, but now, yeah, I've just got to film yeah. some reels. I've got to call my team at the office. I just like, I really struggle having days. Well, just like even that, just being by myself, going for an ocean swim. I tried to embrace it and just like be in the moment, but I just, I feel so guilty. Like being a mom, having three companies, having people in the office, I'm like, oh, I just feel bad. So anyway, I'm gonna go film real. I've got to do some stuff for Topeka and yeah. Okay, yes, she's there too. I should have brought the GoPro down. I didn't because I just, yeah, you want to tell them what happened? I got yeah. a nada. You went under the water. Yeah. Showed him the GoPro footage of me swimming under the water and like opening my eyes under the water. And he was like, kind of jing himself up. He's like, okay, okay, we go. I go under. By the way, this is why I'm puffing. I'm carrying this all the way from the beach. He went under and I wish I brought the GoPro, but he had the best little swim. It's almost end of day, like end of work day. So we want to go and get ice blocks and bring it into everyone in the office because he wants to celebrate with ice cream. Yeah, Scarlett's leaving work in 10 minutes. She's been in the office all day. Jimmy. We've watched The Grinch like five times in the last two weeks. Is that I don't know what, what that bit says? is. Yeah, that's right. You're so tired. Yeah, you're so tired. Yeah, you're so tired. Okay, what about the other one? What about the hey, hey, hey? Double hate. Loath. Do it. You're so tired. I think that's what he thinks it is, the load. Oh, it's, 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 hmm. 
Hate, hate, hate. Double hate. Loof. Yeah, I can <laughs> Anyway, I have been waiting all day. Oh my gosh. Uh, we ended up going in the ocean again. I went in by myself. Then me and Fox went and I forgot to bring the GoPro, but you kind of saw clips of it. And then after we dropped all the ice creams to the office, my little sister was like, can you please come swimming with me? I've got ice cream. So what you happened? did eat ice cream. What happened when Talia went in the ocean and you were in all your clothing? Did you go in? Yeah, right. In your clothes? Yeah. Let's open this. <laughs> Let's open that. You, you come. Okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. Show me, show me. Quick. Um, quick, 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 quick. Faster, faster, faster. Put the snow there. In that one? Yeah. No, I think it goes over there. Oh, yeah, we there? Uh, no, not there. Here. In yeah. front of this. Yeah, you need the ladder. Yeah, we'll need a ladder, but we're not doing it tonight. We're just going to open it tonight. Put it now. No, I can't do it now. It's too, too noisy. And you got to go to bed. Ooh. This is the top part of the door. This holds the door. And it's what color is it? It's gold. The track is gold. Open this. Hate, hate, hate. Double hate. No. No, you tired. No, no, no. Does mommy like the color? American no. oak. I'm tired. Are you? Are you going to bed? Yeah. Say goodnight, mom. Give mom a big kiss and a cuddle. You go, you go. My tired mom go bed. Me, my dummy, me, my dummy go. <laughs> the fact that he me. actually puts himself to bed me now, like. Me, my dummy go in the eat. Like, I do want to go in bed. I'm so, tired. Say hoo hoo. Hoo hoo. I'm tired. Right, see ya. See yeah. ya. <laughs> yeah, I'll make the bottle. You go in the bed. Who's that kid? <laughs> Oh my. my gosh. I'm being very, very naughty right now. So Kurt asked me what I want for Christmas. Literally all I want is a bike. And you guys may remember What's Dot, R.I.P. Bike. Purple. Yeah. I got brown. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. <laughs> but I used to have Dot, my pink bike. And I rode her everywhere. Like I had her before I was a mum. I think Kurt bought her for me actually. And um, anyway, her front tire fell off. <laughs> She wasn't like a super high quality bike, but she did the trick. She was amazing. So it was basically going to be just as expensive to like fix her. So I figured we would get a new bike and it's been hiding. It's been hiding in our pool room, which this is the room next to our pool, which we still need to work out. <gasps> it looks cute. Do you like it? I love it. So I obviously couldn't get pink again because that would just be like rude to Dot. I don't know what I'm gonna do with her yet, but. We'll probably sell her. I don't know. So yeah, Dot's my old bike. R.I.P. Dot. We need to rename this. Don't say a name. I will think of it. Don't you say it. Giuseppe. Anything. I knew it would be Giuseppe. When, when, whenever you name anything Giuseppe. When we had that, that dog doorstop Giuseppe. When we got Abby, Giuseppe. When I said, I'm pregnant for the first time, Giuseppe. Oh, I haven't, we're having another boy, Giuseppe. His name is not Giuseppe. Okay, okay. You know what the best part is? Mummy has to wear a helmet. But she's got to wear one of Fox's one because the only thing that'll fit her head. She real pretty. What are you looking at? Myself oh. in the mirror with my back. <laughs> yes. Is your seat at the right height? Yep. It's a bit high. But yeah, we'll okay. have to put that down a little bit. Not now. Yeah, yeah. No, let's go. No, 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 oh, no, no. I can, it took me two seconds to put the seat down. No, you need it. You need it just a little bit lower. I'm okay. Because if you stack it with a baby, I don't want you killing our baby. I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> Can I just wear my snowboarding one? No, wear this one. I don't know what your snowboarding one is. Who's, whose helmet is this? My one. <laughs> Alright, this is 100 percent gonna fit. This is gonna fit. What does it say about my brain capacity? Oh, it's bang on perfect, isn't it? That's actually a great fit on you. You look cool though. At least I'm it's a cool helmet. You, like when I tell people, when I tell people no hats fit me because I have a child size head. I don't mean a kid size head. I mean a toddler size head. Yeah, Sarah's small because I'm always like filming at this height. So you're like always at head height. Whereas if I was to actually, people, look, I, when this, people, is my, this is my view of you. When people meet me in real life, they go, you're so small. You're actually tiny from this angle. <laughs> that's, that's where my eyes are. Hello. <laughs> Every time I do like a meetup or something, people say, oh, you're really short. Because <laughs> I go from this angle. Let's
that hurt me. Yeah. <laughs> You having the best time? Yeah, I did the best time. The best time ever? Yeah, a best day. <laughs> best day. Best day. Yeah. Best day. Lucky it's Sarah's day. Yeah, it's day. It's good. Job putting the sauce on, man. <laughs> He's doing so good at that. I'll finish. Oh, fish. <laughs> I wanted to, again, I keep wanting to do ASMR cooking and it's just not working for me because there's just chaos everywhere. It's my Christmas party today. I'm having 18 adults here plus five kids plus five babies. So it's hectic. We've never done this before, but I feel like great investment, great use of time and money. We have asked one of our friends, we've, we're paying him like an hourly rate to come and do some outdoor work for us. So Lockie is doing a lot of the outdoor stuff. Say good morning, everyone. Good morning, everyone. And say happy Christmas party day. Happy party day. Yeah. I woke up early and went to the gym. I'm still disgusting and sweaty, but like I'll have a shower after. Kurt is prepping to put the door up. Yeah. So I'm currently making two potato bakes. So because obviously the Christmas party is at my house, I'm doing the bulk of the cooking, but everyone is bringing like a decent big dish. If you go onto Sunny and type in potato and scroll down to the bottom, the creamy potato bake, oh, it's by far one of my favorite recipes on Sunny. It's so wholesome and Christmassy and filling. So it's a creamy potato bake. So this one is gluten-free and dairy-free. The only reason it's not vegan is because we do put bacon on the top, but you can totally remove the bacon and then it's vegan. So I'm making one of the Sunny creamy potato bakes. And then I'm also making my mum's creamy potato bake because I know the boys like dairy and cream and cheese. So yeah, I'm doing 15 potatoes. I feel like a real mum. You know what I mean? Like I'm having Christmas dinner, making like two big batches of potato bakes. I need to go and get chicken skewers. I still have to go up the street and buy a bunch of stuff. Fox, what are you watching? Bluey. Bluey. If you're an Aussie mum, you know Bluey. We were gonna do a big line of tables out the back so everyone can sit on it, but I feel like it is kind of impeding. Maybe we would do it how I did it last year and do like a big L shape, because then we can play outside. Let's do that. Let's just configure it and then we'll make a decision. Okay, it's like two hours later. I'm basically all organized. I'm showered. I'm ready. My outfit, you will either love, maybe you'll be like, that's yeah, okay, or you'll hate it. Like, Kurt doesn't hate it. He just doesn't like the color. I have just been loving green, and it's very comfortable on my baby bump, and it's terry toweling. So if I get wet because Fox will probably go swimming, then it's fun. Look, I'm just trying to justify it. Let's be honest. I like the dress, and Kurt hates it. I feel like if Kurt ever hates my dress or my outfit, I like explain why it makes sense or I explain why I like it. Why do you not like my dress? No, I don't like the colour. Yeah. Can you show them an outfit of the day? Mm -hmm. Show it off. Do you think it's fun? Um, it's very Christmassy. It is Christmassy. I just don't like that colour green. Why? You look pretty, except if it was in a different colour, I would love it more. Like if that was in like a sand colour, oh yeah, baby. Here's my oh thing. baby. We hate him. No. Here's my no. thing. I'm your no. Kanye. Oh I my am your not Kanye. my Kanye. <laughs> Here's my thing. Like I wear so much white and beige and tan and sand. I want to mix it up. I want to have some colour. So I par baked. I pretty much fully cooked the potato base. This is the dairy one, like my mum's one. So I just need to add a bit more cheese on top and a little bit more bacon. And then I'll bake it for another like 20, 30 minutes. And then this is the almost vegan. It's dairy free with bacon. This is the no. more wholesome one, I guess you could say, the dairy-free no. one. And I'll just add some extra vegan cheese on top and then I'll bake that for like 20 minutes as well. Your hair is a mess and your friends will be here in like half an hour. So we need to go and get ready. And then I'm gonna get all the snacks together and like Where put them it? put them on here. We're not going anywhere, your friends are coming here. So we need to get ready. 